Welcome to the He's Got Issues DC Comics Edition number 4. I'm John Cooney here to preview new DC Comics being released March 13th, 2013. Beginning alphabetically with Batgirl number 18. The first of two issues by guest writer Ray Fox. Batgirl must face the man who sold her out to the Joker during death of the family, her own brother, James Gordon Jr. Can Barbara help him, or will this conflict be the final nail in their family coffin? Next, we've got Batman number 18. Welcome guest artist Andy Kubert. In the wake of unspeakable tragedy, Batman is in danger of losing his humanity. Fan favorite character Harper Rowe returns. Will she be able to pull Batman back from the brink? And we've got Batman and Robin number 18. You dare not miss this issue. It's the Batman and Robin story of the year. We've got Batman Arkham Unhinged number 12, an all-new digital adventure in print for the first time. Based on the hit video game Batman Arkham City, a mob of criminals lay siege to a church to capture Mayor Sharp. With Batman nowhere to be found, will Azrael save the day? We've got Before Watchmen Ozzy Mendias number 6 of 6, with the pull quote, Remember that island I mentioned buying a few years back? And we've got Deathstroke number 18, finally Deathstroke versus the Teen Titans. You want more? You got more, as the Ravagers join the fight. We've got Demon Knights number 18, after 30 years the Demon Knights are slowly pulling themselves back together, but there's an army of vampires waiting to tear them apart. What punishment does Xanadu have in store for Etrigan the Demon? We've got Green Lantern Corps number 18, Wrath of the First Lantern continues, the First Lantern has already devastated Kyle Rayner, now he sets his sights on Carol Ferris and the rest of the New Guardians. How will the First Lantern's unique, sadistic power shatter the lives of Larflees, St. Walker, Arkillo, and the rest? Next, we've got Green Lantern, the animated series number 12. When a Red Lantern ring finds its way into the heart of the planet Greykill, it causes havoc. This time, the Interceptor crew needs help from Mogo. And we've got Katana number 2. Katana has joined the Deadly Sword Clan in the hopes that they'll lead her further down the path to vengeance. Katana has been contacted by Steve Trevor, but what does the Justice League of America want with her? We've got Ravagers number 10. Someone claiming to be Terra's brother comes to the team. Unfortunately, Deathstroke the Terminator isn't far behind him. The Ravagers are having serious trust issues already, so a visit from the world's deadliest assassin certainly won't help. We've got Saucer Country number 13. On election night, Arcadia's chances of reaching the highest office in the land are too close to call, just like Professor Kidd's chances of holding on to his sanity. In part two of President's Day, our heroes are forced to ask, whose side are the flying saucers on? Next, we've got Suicide Squad number 18. It's rematch time as Basilisk faces off against the Suicide Squad. What or who is so important that Amanda Waller would risk stepping into the field herself? We've got Superboy number 18, Hell on Earth has ended, and Superboy is about to land in a new city with a new secret identity and a surprising new foe on his trail, guest starring Superman. We've got Team 7 number 6, in the tale from the recent past, Team 7 is on a mission to rescue Caitlin Fairchild when a team member dies. And in the present day, Deathstroke hunts down his former Team 7 partners, but why? And we've got Threshold number 3. Former Green Lantern Jediah Call leads an assault on the powers behind the game. A very ill-advised assault. Introducing Captain Carrot. In the backup feature, the hunt for Larflees' stuff turns up evidence that the theft was an inside job. Out in trades this week, we've got all-new Batman The Brave and the Bold Small Miracles trade paperback. This all-ages title guest stars DC superheroes including Superman, Wonder Woman, The Flash, Martian Manhunter, and more. Collects Batman The Brave and the Bold 15, 17, the all-new Batman The Brave and the Bold 13 through 16. We've got Earth 2 Volume 1, The Gathering trade paperback. Who are the heroes of Earth 2? When the Batman, Wonder Woman, and Superman of Earth 2 fall in battle, it's up to a new breed of heroes to come together to combat the returning evil of Apocalypse. Collects issues 1 through 6 of the Red Hot DC Comics New 52 series. And last, we've got I, Vampire Volume 2, Rise of the Vampires trade paperback. In the second New 52 collection, Andrew Bennett finds himself in a place he never thought he'd reach during his countless decades walking the Earth. But his absence on Earth signals a deadly loss of order in the vampire hierarchy, and the savage attacks on humanity he's long feared looks like it's coming to pass. Plus, the vampire pilgrimage begins, but along the way they encounter an ancient enemy, the Van Helsings. Collects I Vampire 7 through 12 and Justice League Dark 7 and 8. 
Okay, so that's it for DC this week, but there's still plenty of other books out as well, so be sure to check out my YouTube channel at he's got issues dot com to see both the Marvel and Indies videos for this week, as well as my featured video with the usual roundup of all my favorites for the week with a little more depth and insight than you get here. And if you like these videos, be sure to let me know by leaving a comment and subscribing. You can also follow He's Got Issues on Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest to see everything I'm reading as I read it. So until next week, I'm John Cooney, and I've got issues.